Hello and welcome back to the next episode of the Quickfire Tutorial Series. In this episode, I'm going to be talking about multiple um, country starts or nation starts on a planet, as well as um, creating NPRs, creating uh, player races, and how that all works uh, in general. So the first thing I'm going to do is you're just going to generate a normal player race like normal on a solar system, for example, on Earth or on another world. And then you're going to go over here, you're going to make sure S, uh, M is on, or Space Master. You're going to select uh, the world you want to put the MPR on, or the player rays. So for this, uh, there's two different ways of doing it. There's the way that people in ARs like Garfunkel do it. And then there's the way where, there's the ways that you can do it if you want to do with it AI characters. So go over here, you're going to click Create Race. And then you can fill out all the information you want here. You can click non-player race and that will make them an AI and they'll do their own thing. They'll spawn in with their own points and stuff and they'll uh, operate in that way. And you can create how they appear. You can also, without clicking that, click neutral race. And this will mean that when they spawn, they won't just immediately kill you. But you can set what they want to here um, accordingly. And they will be neutral. You can also set, uh, you can also set, um, you know, what are they going to be doing uh, by go clicking off neutral, and you can set more stuff. But neutral, you just have to put these in yourself, and this allows you to basically control back and forth. So I'm what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a uh, neutral NPR, and this will mean they won't attack you either. They have a, a certain treaty length. If we have a look. Um, I believe it's somewhere in the starting settings if we go over here. Oh yeah, it wants me to create a base. Sorry about that noise. Um cancel. And if we go over here, uh choose countdown. So what you want to do is let's say 10 years. So this will be in years. So this means uh who share the same system as their card puzzle. Um, so this means that you can have multiple MPRs on Earth, as you can see down here. So, what you can do then, is if I spawn in an MPR, create race, non-player race, create race, and they're going to share that on Earth. So, boom. <laughs> Let's turn that off. So now we have an MPR on Earth with everything generated accordingly, as you can see here. And then if I wanted to create a player race, which I can then control, you can't control the NPRs or modify how they act or are. Um, if I wanted to change that, I can then go create race, neutral, or just player race. If I want to go neutral, that'll be completely neutral. If I want to go player race, I can make a conventional, I can do whatever, create race. And then they'll have their own, all their, their countries called, and then you can switch between this and that, and you can control the actions of the individual race that you want to be controlling. So if you want to control um, Memmingham here, you know, each individually their control is slightly different. And if you, a, a big tip as well, it's all Windows linked to race. So if I have uh, this and then I switch to that, it will, it will, it will switch accordingly. But if, for example, I'm on Memmingham Imperium and I decide I want, I change to that, it will switch the tactical map as well. But if I turn this off and I go over here and I switch to this, it will not. So that is a big tip there for if you want to um, do this kind of stuff. Now in ARs, like Garfunkel's, he has 10 player races that he controls individually, which is a mad lad. And I'm quite... I, I can't believe how long it takes to make those uh, ARs. I, I know myself how long it takes with one race, um, but 10, um, even though it's on a smaller scale, obviously. Um, so this is just generally how you set up your MPRs accordingly um, and how you um, can, can create MPRs, create uh, player races, have multiple Earth Star. Remember, you're going to want to be putting down uh, that truce countdown. Otherwise, they, uh, they, will be, they will be murdering you very, very quickly. So save, make sure you save those things, and then that will mean that they won't attack you for at least 10 years. 
and you can also create player bases which you can act however you want and you can create um, neutral bases which won't do anything towards you etc etc and that's it um thank you for watching this has been um a great uh, tutorial and i'll see you next time remember to like and subscribe There's only about 20 percent of the people who watch these videos actually subscribe it does really help out the channel we just passed 225 subscribers so please do so i'll see you later stay safe um and uh, bye bye